breaking news as Atlanta police now know the name of a suspect in the week's murder of rapper Slim Duncan. Let's go straight to Channel 2's Ryan Young at Atlanta Police Headquarters with more on the alleged gunman named. Ryan. Justin, we've been working on this, and just in the last 14 minutes, I've been able to get these two pictures right here of the suspect they've been looking for. They say he's known as a rapper of Young Vito in the circles of Atlanta. We want to let the public know that the individual that we believe is responsible for the death of Slim Duncan, and that would be uh, Mr. Mario Hamilton, is in fact Vincent Hardiman, known in rap circles and known in the uh, recording industry as Young Vito. He is a local rapper in this particular city. Detective David Quinn just identified to me the man Atlanta police are looking for in connection with the shooting of rapper Slim Duncan. We first showed you the recording studio where the rapper and another man fought over a piece of candy. That led to Mario Hamilton, a.k.a. Slim Duncan, getting shot in the chest. Now police have the information they say they need it. We want to reach out to young Vito, Vincent Hardiman to come holla at us. The shooting happened Friday at this Memorial Drive recording studio. Slim Duncan, who stood six foot eight, was taken to Grady Hospital by friends where he would die. Since then, there's been a push to get witnesses who are not talking to talk to police and open up about the shooting. I want the family of, of Mr. Vincent Hardiman to give us a call. Let us know. We, we are fearful for his safety because we don't want anything to happen to him. Now warrants have been signed and police are searching for the rapper known as Young Vito. This is Friday night, Ryan. The cold case squad has been working diligently trying to put different facts together to bring this case to closure. So they are looking for young Vito right now. As you heard, they want to make sure nothing happens to him before he gets a chance to turn himself in. I've been working my sources on this case since the moment this shooting happened. And now you can see the picture of the man they are looking for. The warrant has been signed, and police are looking for their suspect. Reporting live in Atlanta Police Headquarters, Ryan Young, Channel 2 Action News.